What's going on guys? This is Maxintosh Productions here. Um, I'm going to do a how-to video on how to get your iTunes uh, songs lyrics. How to get lyrics for your iTunes songs. Now most of the songs that you buy, or uh, hopefully you're not downloading them, uh, the songs illegally because obviously that's illegal, it's bad, and you need to show support for your fellow artists uh, that you're downloading the songs for, so you have to use iTunes to buy our music. Um, anyways, <laughs> most of the songs that you buy or download are not going to come with lyrics, so what you need to do is um, get an application called Get Lyrical. It's a very lightweight application, very user-friendly. I'm going to teach you a step-by-step -step little guide on how to do this. So once you open the application up, this is the window that's going to pop up. Um, it's very lightweight, it's very small, compact, uh, in one little box. So um, if you want the lyrics to, let's say, Forever Neuromix, you're just going to highlight it, make sure it's blue, go into your Get Lyrical application, and we're going to open this a uh, little eye right here, which shows the lyrics. And then we're going to tag current. Alright, if you have a green light, that means it successfully tagged your lyrics, which is good. And now when you right-click this, get info, you're going to have your lyrics right here. Okay, but by default, you guys, um, when you're running Get Lyrical, by default, uh, if you go up to the file menu, you're going to have include lyrical header checked and include lyrical footer checked. You should uncheck those because when you're in your lyrics up here, uh, in your iTunes, when you're in your lyrics, it's going to say the song name, blah, blah, blah. It's going to say the artist's name and all this unnecessary info that you don't need. And also at the bottom, it's going to say the website uh, that Get Lyrical got the lyrics from. And that's totally unnecessary in my opinion because... Of course, when you're clicking uh, Get Info in Lyrics, when you're going to this Lyrics tab over here, you already know what the song name is going to be. Why would you want to, uh, uh, you know, have the song name already written above those lyrics? That just makes no sense to me. So that's a quick and easy fix. You don't need to get a script to make that work. And if you want to uh, get multiple lyrics for multiple songs, uh, you just highlight like this. You click one song, hold Shift and go to your desired song that you want to highlight. Go to Get Lyrical and click this little uh, tag selection thing. Would you like to overwrite existing lyrics? I'm going to click Yes and this window is going to pop up up here. Uh, this is going to load up. It's going to say how many seconds are left I believe. So, you know, uh, that's, that's how it's going to work. Okay, here we go. It's done. It says found three of five. I selected five songs. It only found three successfully. That's not bad. Uh, we're going to show the untagged ones. These are the ones that did not uh, uh, successfully uh, find any lyrics. But, you know, it's not bad. You got three out of five. That's more than the less you didn't get. Anyways, if I'm not making sense to you, just don't listen to me. I hope this tutorial helped you, uh, you guys. And also, by the way, I forgot to mention, uh, in Get Lyrical over here where it says active tagging. Um, if you're playing your music, right, if you're just playing your music and you select active tagging, um, it's going to automatically find lyrics for you in Get Lyrical. It's going to automatically do the, the little magic thing it does. All right, peace guys. Please subscribe. Um, if I get 800 subscribers, I will be giving away a $25 gift card. Uh, of your choice for Walmart, Best Buy, anywhere, GameStop, you name it, you will get it if you win. Peace!